I started my YouTube channel three months ago, and now I want to get monetized within the next 90 days. Am I crazy? I might be crazy, but if I don't get monetized soon, I'm not gonna be able to afford to eat. So for the next 90 days, I'm pouring everything that I have into getting my channel monetized. Is this goal impossible? No. But is it challenging? Absolutely. For those of you who don't know, YouTube monetization involves being accepted into the YouTube Partner Program. Once you're a YouTube Partner, you receive 55% of the ad revenue that YouTube receives from ads placed on your videos. There are currently two ways you can get accepted into the YouTube Partner Program. The first way is if you get 1,000 subscribers on your channel and 4,000 watch hours on your videos in the last 365 days. The second way is if you get 1,000 subscribers on your channel and 10 million views on your shorts in the last 90 days. So so how close am I to these thresholds? Well, as of today, July 10th at 9 p.m., I have 559 subscribers, 329 public watch hours, and 12,000 shorts views. Am I far away from my goal? Yes. But is it hopeless? No. Because I have a game plan. <laughs> I took that from Ryan Trahan. These videos are awesome, and if you haven't seen them, you should definitely check them out. What's the game plan, you ask? Well, based on what I've tried on YouTube so far, I'm going to target the watch hour approach to getting monetized. I am much closer to 4,000 watch hours than I am to 10 million shorts views. And after previously uploading one short per day for 30 days straight, I realized that hardly any of my shorts viewers were converting into subscribers. Because I need to focus on getting more subscribers in addition to getting more watch hours, producing longer form videos as opposed to shorts is probably gonna be my best bet for getting monetized on YouTube. Okay, so we're targeting the watch hour approach. Got it. But how in the world are we going to get 441 subscribers and 3,761 watch hours in 90 days? Here's the strategy. First, I'm going to amp up the cadence of my uploads and start uploading two long form videos per week. The more videos I push out in the next 90 days, the more opportunities I have for one of my videos to hit the algorithm and bring in more views. When it comes to the videos themselves, all my videos up until this point have been quite long, averaging at around 15 minutes long. I really like the videos that I've created so far and I'm really proud of them but they just take too long to create. My most recent video about Katherine Manning involved 35 pages of notes. I just don't have enough time to do all of that if I wanna release two videos per week for the next 90 days. So instead, I'm going to focus on creating shorter videos between six to eight minutes long. Additionally, the longer the video, the more expensive the editing. So far, I use an editor for all my videos on my channel, but that might change soon. I'm editing this one myself. I love my editor and I think that the quality of their edits is fantastic but they're just too expensive. So for the next 90 days, my videos will probably be a combination of edited myself and edited by a less expensive editor. I haven't made up my mind completely about what the mix will be. It'll be a balance of how much time I have to edit and how much I can afford to outsource, but I will keep you updated. So the plan is to release two six to eight minute long videos per week either edited by yours truly or by a hired editor. Got it. But what about the content of the videos themselves? What am I going to make videos about in order to get monetized in the next 90 days? Well, for the first month, I really wanna try out the concept of fame jacking. Essentially, this means leveraging the name and reputation of a celebrity in order to create more familiarity with a viewer. For example, if I create a video titled My Process for Making Thumbnails from Start to Finish, no one is really going to care because why would they? They have no idea who I am and they don't trust me. But if I make a video titled Mr. Beast's process for making thumbnails from start to finish, a lot more people are going to care and be interested in watching it because they already know who Mr. Beast is and they already trust and admire him. Now, obviously I know this is going to take a lot of deep research into a lot of specific creators, but I've done it before for Katherine Manning and for Dr. Mike, so I believe in myself. So I'm going to try fame jacking for the first 30 days. Additionally, I'll create build in public videos like these on a regular basis. So anyone can follow along the journey and see the behind the scenes of the analytics, watch hours, strategies, and all that good stuff in real time. So if you're interested in this challenge, subscribe to follow along my journey to YouTube monetization. I can't say for certain if I'm going to succeed, but I do know for sure that I'm going to pour everything that I have into getting there. This is day one. My 90 days begins now. I'll see you in the next video. Game plan.